Hello again, everybody, and welcome to another edition of Jeremy's Kitchen. I saw yet another video from Chef Gordon Ramsay on a recipe that he did that seemed absolutely simple and with ingredients that I could easily get my hands on. And so tonight I'm trying going to make a special dinner for my family. Today I'm going to make spicy sausage rice. Now, this video is going to be a little different because this part I'm just going to do prep work. So I, because it is only 1.45 in the afternoon and it is too early to start cooking dinner. So let me show you what I'm going to do first. This is hot Italian sausage, red onion, red pepper, and two cloves of garlic. I'm just going to go, I'm just going to prepare those right now. Okay. All right, I'm going to start with our red onion. I'm starting to like this serrated, serrated knife. All right, so cut off the ends. And peel off the, the outer skin here. Good. <laughs> okay, let me get rid of this little tip right over here. Please. There. Okay, now cut your red onion in half. And then what you're gonna do is you're simply gonna go chop chopping up and down. Two fingers in back, one in front, and go up and down. Now, my vegetable, my onions are going to go in to this container. I got this side to cut. Good, 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 good. All right, red pepper is cut. Now, yeah, we'll use that. All right, next container. This will be for our red pepper. Now, upon watching Chef Ramsay's video, I saw a very interesting way on how he cut this. So, what you do, this side goes on the bottom and cut all around all sides, like this. Wasting no part of the of the um, pepper. That's gone. You gotta get rid of the membrane and the remaining seeds that are in there. There. Yeah. All right, now we can cut this up.
There you go. Next, um, dee -bee -dee -bee. Yeah. That'll work. two cloves of garlic. What you're gonna do is use the, your knife, the flat end of your knife, hit out the shell. like that and just like that and just start cutting No, I'm going to do that too. Uh, you know what? No. What I was thinking of doing was uh, cutting up two tomatoes in order to uh, get those ready. Because that's going to be in our final segment of the dish. But I think that can wait. So, now I want to take a paring knife. Open up my sausage packet. This, as I said, is spicy, hot Italian sausage. And all I'm going to do with these is just cut them out of the casing. Of course, it has to cut. Yeah. There we are. The one thing about the dish that I will be doing tonight is it's flavor on top of flavor on top of flavor. And that's one thing that'll make this dish so very special is the just the absolute delicious taste of of the rice when I'm all set and done with it. Um I need something bigger than that. Uh, yeah, actually, yeah, this, this, this one will work right here perfectly. Because, again, because this is going to break. So it doesn't really matter how, it, what, if it goes in there broken or not. All right, nice. Yes, right out. Mm. 
again, as I said, it doesn't matter if it comes broken right at this point in time because it's gonna be broken up and stirred it together in the salsa in the in the rice mixture anyway, so And one more to go. Right. Okay. Nah. You know what? I wasn't gonna do this, but you know what? I might as well cut up the other vegetables that are needed. Okay, first order of business. Let me take like that off for a sec. I'm gonna get the other two vegetables that I need. Take these two, these two, and you. Okay. Two tomato, two Roma tomatoes. Slice them in half and just dice them up. There you go. Let the weight of the knife work. Do it with your. Try not to put down as much pressure on the knife or you'll spoil it. This may all get squashed. Alright. Working. Tomato. broke my own golden, my own rule by putting pressure well, on the knife, but with my fingers. Okay, that's okay, but that's done. I need a, uh, yeah, I think I'll use you, and I'll take a lid. Huh. Two o'clock in the afternoon. To the container you're going. Now, one final thing I'm going to do is I'm not going to use this board for it because it's already wet. Not just the water, but with the tomato and everything else. And I'd like my board to be as dry as I can. And so I'll use a different knife for this part. So, here. I'm going to use this green cutting board, which is for vegetables. 
Canada. This is parsley. And I'm going to finally chop this parsley as much as I can. This is the last component to add into the dish. Mmm, that's actually cool. I can actually smell the parsley leaves on there. As I'm, sli as I'm cutting them off, I can smell it. Okay. Good. That should be enough. Now. All right. And I believe our prep work is completed all right now let's get a container for all of this yeah this will work All right, good. Ah. Seal that off. And also we can seal off the sausage. All right. Ah. Okay, good. All right, well, all of our prep work for our Spicy sausage rice is now completed, and uh, in a few hours, I will start cooking dinner, and you will all be invited to watch me cook it. All right, so I will see you in a few hours. Talk to you guys soon.